All right, folks. Hey, I'm Amy. Snowman Jones. Yep. And today we're looking at some of Witness. Ric Flair. <gasps> Woo! Woo! You nailed it. You nailed it. I didn't love it. I didn't love it. Oh, it didn't yeah. feel good. It didn't you made feel me humble. Good. You <laughs> broke my back and made me humble. We've just covered the Iron Sheik in a recent I episode. I love him. Yeah, we're going to make you humble. Um, Ric Flair's wildest <laughs> interview. So I was like, I don't know what I just said. No, 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 we're not. Exactly. <laughs> I don't know. Are you breaking my back or are you... <laughs> Let's just move forward, folks. <laughs> I ain't cliving. Um, Ric Flair's wildest interviews. Let's watch a few in comment from WWE.com. He has fantastic hair. Oh, yeah. Kenny Rogers has nothing on that chest. Uh, no, don't talk shit about Kenny Rogers. They can both be great. I've been on this one for 10 years. And I've done it all. And I've paid all the dues. I'm going to pay. Is that a sausage? Is that you guys? Does he get naked? I've never seen this interview. Don't take it off, you'll hurt your neck. Yeah. Is that a I'm sausage? so afraid of the bat. Is that a bat? What is it? What, like, first off, I have to cover his necklace. What is up with his necklace? Okay, I don't know. That's amazing. I, he has a gold medallion. Yeah? Do we, can we tell what it is? No, nah, it's got to be a winged eagle, you would think. Huh. <laughs> That's pretty cool, though. The flowing, how long would it take to get a person's hair looking like that in the morning? How much time must he spend? Oh, a lot. He, would he must blow dry and fluff. He has a fluffer of some sort that yeah, takes care of that. Like a, just a lot of cool products, probably. I should ask. I I've heard he's know. declared bankruptcy a few times. Like he's, he's been rough with finances, even though he made millions here. Because he's he just spent. Like, yeah, on gold those gold and, and Those are nice clothes. Hair. And haircuts. So, I also wanted to point out... Uh-oh. Yep, sorry. Um, Skip forward. His bat thing. Yeah. It's a skull. I know, skull. Like, that's a tobacco brand, that's I believe. That's what I thought. You can't do that in WWE anymore I today, so, I would no. think. Mid-Atlantic had no rules, I would think. So. Yeah, I don't think they're um, advertising tobaccos to right. children anymore. Next, let's go, scoot forward to this interview oh. and discuss this look. I love it. I know. Like, can I get a wig like that and go whatever that is for Halloween? Look, I'm very in favor of feathered bangs and hair. Second <laughs> <laughs> moment, already fine business executive. And you know what? He has too many teeth in his mouth, like, yeah. so many teeth, <laughs> so Scott, many teeth. Scott, <laughs> Scott Steiner um, did a, like, an interview, like, on TV, mm -hmm. and said, you spent all this money, why don't you spend some money to get that snaggle tooth fixed, and he took so much personal offense to it. Oh, no, like, it was a real, does, like, oh, yeah. Some of the best in the world. I have no idea. I have no idea what that means. 
You're yes. just standing right here in some tall cotton. He's a wild man, I don't you think? I love it, yeah. So Ric Flair is amazing. I think some of this is interesting because... Um, oh, he's got that medallion on there. Yeah, he did get the medallion again. He likes that medallion. Like well, it. let's ah, see if we can skip through this commercial. This is what YouTube will do to you. Mm -hmm. But Ric Flair's amazing, right? The Four Horsemen were not big guys, though. By today's yeah. standards, like, I mean, I don't know how tall Arn Anderson was, who's a beast and possibly a god, yeah. but maybe 5'10", 230, yeah. like, I would think in real life, like, real weight. Skip. Oh, we're so close. <laughs> you get it right at the end. All right, let's 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 see this Champion. WWE, WWF okay, version. Yo, with a tear in my eye, this is the greatest moment in my life. When you walk around this world and you tell everybody you're number one, Ooh. the only way you get to stay number one is to be number one. And this is the only title in the wrestling world that makes you number one. When you are the king of the WWF, you rule the world. Think about it like that. There was a lot of controversy, like, later in his career that he needed to cut his hair. Because he went back to the flowing hair after this again. Yeah. And there's a lot of people saying he should cut his golden locks. Why? I can't imagine. It looks amazing. No, it looks cool. And that's, like, his thing. Yeah. yeah. So here he is after he cut his hair a little bit. Cut yourself five times! That's incredible. Yeah. I love... I hear everything you have to say. I love... I... I Gene is quickly becoming my favorite entity in all of wrestling <laughs> because I love watching him just be like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, yeah. so you see that on the screen behind us, yes. Ric Flair's face. Yeah. We're going to have a contest. Uh -huh. Who can make that face better? Okay. I've already got the nose for it. You have to go the same angle as what's on screen. Woo! I think you win. <laughs> That's the nose. I got it. That's amazing. So he's just taking his clothes off and he's challenging Eric Bischoff to, to let him run WCW for 90 days. I, I'll give you fight. everything I have. Okay. And if you win, you get everything I have. If I win, I get to run WCW. Did he win? I think so. I ran WCW for a while. That's fun. That's amazing. <laughs> I always thought it would be like a fun gimmick. And they did this a little bit. They had, Actually, they did um, when Raw was trying to get the ratings up. They brought in a celebrity, a different celebrity every week, and made him the commissioner to make matches. And like Bob Barker would come in. And, oh, that's fun. Yeah. Oh, I like so, it. So praise the Lord, that was amazing. Yeah. Um, but letting special people, I always thought like a different man, a different GM every day would be, or like every week or something like yeah. that would be fun. Different wrestlers would be like, well, I'm the GM this week, and guess what? I'm going to get a championship match. Yeah. <laughs> you know? I, I like Just pull a name out of the idea. hat, and you're the new man, general manager. Yep, I like it. All right, folks, thanks again for watching. Click like and subscribe. That is... I'm Amy. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm Snowman Jones. Click like and subscribe and... Adios, amigos. Are you looking to lose weight and get in shape? Want to increase your energy and get a better night's sleep? Then it's time to try Rest More and Thinergy, the ultimate weight loss pack. Rest More will help you get a deeper night's sleep while Thinergy will give you more energy during the day. These two groundbreaking advancements will create a synergy to give you more energy, boost your metabolism, and make you feel 10 years younger. So if you want better sleep, an appetite suppressant that works, and the energy to work to burn those calories during the day, check out Restmore and Thinergy. Now available together on Amazon. They will revolutionize your life.